Today we're going to make this really fun, naughty cross stitch. This shop has been compensated by Collective Bias and its advertiser, but all opinions are my own. You can download the pattern to make this cross stitch over at smartfundiy.com and there'll be a link up here where there's that little eye in the corner. Now just follow the pattern and you're basically going to make X's. So you'll put the Ada cloth, which is cross stitch material into the embroidery hoop and then just go ahead and follow the pattern. You're going to count count a cross stitch so you're going to count how many x's you need to make each direction make the x's take the cloth out of the embroidery hoop trim it to a few inches wider than a piece of chipboard so you want to be a few inches wider than the words themselves then you'll wrap the cloth around the chipboard and then stitch the back together so you're going to stitch the sides to each other stretched across the back and then the top and the bottom to each other across the back then cut a piece of felt a little bit smaller than the size of your cross stitch and you will put a piece of string across the back basically like a loop and this is going to make a really simple and easy hanger so i just tied a piece of embroidery floss to itself to make a little loop add some hot glue all over the back of that and then put it onto the back of your cross stitch. So this is what's gonna make it look finished. Now you can put this in a frame if you want to or do something a little bit fancier, but I thought this is a quick and easy sign to make. Um, super simple for the bathroom with, for your poopery. So on the back here, I'm adding some eyelet lace and then I'm gonna finish this off on the front. Now you could sew this on, but I just wanna do it super quick. So use hot glue. You could also use fabric glue if you wanted to. So make sure your edges are finished. You're gonna add your pom-poms to the front to make this extra fun. You could also add some appliques, buttons, things like that to make it cute. And then you'll display this in the restroom with poopery. So this is a project to tell your guests, hey, before you make this smell, you want to use some poopery in the bowls. A super fun and silly way to address a stinky problem around the holidays so that nobody has to suffer through going to a smelly bathroom. Thanks so much for watching this. I really appreciate it. And you can hit the subscribe button here so that you can get notifications every time we come out with another smart, fun DIY idea like this.